lovely, aren't you? School's over for the day. Everyone is going home, except Anne and Pamela. They're still in the playground. Look, here's Mr Higgins. Hello, Pamela. Hello, Anne. Hello. That's a very nice dog. Is it lost? Have you looked to see if it's got a name? Yes, it hasn't got one. Well, I think we'd better take it to a police station, don't you? I think that's the best thing to do. Now, I think I've got a piece of string here somewhere. Anne, you pass the police station, don't you? Yes. Do you think you could go in with it and give it to the policeman there? Yes. If you're very careful on the road... There, if I tie that tightly, look. Can you hold that? Now, if you take it straight to the police station and tell them you found a lost dog, do you? Then you're coming home my way, Pamela, aren't you? Anne is going to help the dog find his home. She lives close to the police station. Everyone is very busy in the police station. Well, young lady, what can I do for you? I've found a lost dog. That's a nice dog. Let's have a look in the book and see if anybody's reported him lost, shall we? Yes. It was the first time that Anne had been inside the police station. No, nobody reported him lost. What's your name? Anne Popple. Anne Popple. And when did you find him? Tonight on the way home from school. And what is it, a man dog or a lady dog? I don't know. Hmm. Well, I better have a look, hadn't I? The policeman is writing down all the information. On the wall behind the policeman is a picture showing all sorts of dogs. Anne looks for a dog like the one she has found. No, that's not it. Oh, well, that's the funny one. No, it's not that. No, that. That's more like it. That's it. That's my last dog, a witty. Well then, I think we'd better take him and put him away and see if we can get somebody who wants him to come and find him. Thank right. you, Captain. Well, you can come with me and see if you want to. Come on, you bring him straight. Now the policeman is going to take the lost dog to a kennel. Oh, Miss Spencer, would you take this little girl and this stray dog and put it in the kennel for me, please? Yes, of course. Thank you. Police women do the same job as policemen. The policewoman is taking the dog to a safe place. She is taking her to a kennel and lets Anne go with her. The dog will be safe there until the police find her owner. Anne is very interested in the clothes of the policewoman. She's looking at the policewoman's uniform. Did I your hat? Oh, do you? Would you like to try it on? Yes. This is a new style hat we wear now. Just a pretty, real pretty lady now, aren't you? What's that chain there for? Well, there's a whistle on the end of here. We play the whistle when we want somebody to come and help us. We need assistance. Are you all right? Yes, thank you very much. Hey, can I show this young lady your yes, car? Let me come around. As Anne got into the panda car, the policeman switched on the flashing light. It's like the light on the top of an ambulance, isn't it? Well, um, this is the Next, the policeman tells Anne all about his pocket radio. He uses this to keep in touch with the police station. Mobile one two is calling Charlie two control. It's quite small, and he can carry it with him wherever he goes. Lots of policemen carry one of these. Yes, Charlie two, thank you. Just calling and testing. 
But what's that other noise? It's a policeman on a motorcycle. A motorcycle policeman wears a special uniform. Would you like to show this young lady how yes, your motorcycle works? Try and get on. Anne okay. climbed onto the motorcycle. This policeman oh. also has a radio to keep him in touch with the police station. So if I want to call them up, all I have to do is to press the middle of this and speak to them. Would you like to have a go? I'll call them up for you. Echo Tango 4, calling control on the red, over. Echo Tango 4. Yes, Echo Tango 4. I've got a little girl here who's sitting on the motorbike. She'd like to have a few words with her. Will you speak to her, please, over? Morning, Echo Tango 4. Hello. Hello, little girl. What's your name? I'm Popple. What school do you go to? Town Valley. Do you like it? Yes. Okay, say goodbye to them then. Bye. Echo Tango 4, over and out. Right, would you like to have a ride around the yard? Mm -hmm. Can't go on the road because that's not allowed, you see. Okay, can you move up a little bit? Can I have my hat back before you? Thank you. Wind yourself in. The policewoman has another surprise for Anne. I wonder what it is. It's a policeman brushing a horse. Listen to the sound the brushes make. A policeman who rides a horse is called a mounted policeman. He has to take great care of his horse. Anne was very interested and thought the horse seemed to be enjoying it. Anne had almost forgotten the little dog, but the policeman had been busy and had found her owner. Well, there you are, Mr. Straven. There's your dog. Thank you very much. I'm delighted to have found her. Pretty the name address wasn't on the collar. We should have found it a little bit easier, but uh, the little girl that found us over there, if you want to see her. Oh, yes, I would like to thank her. Well, come on, then. We'll go and see her. Right, thank you. The policeman's quite right. If only the dog had worn her name on her collar, it would have saved a lot of trouble. But Anne's glad she found her and brought her to the police. We've been showing around the police station. Did you enjoy your visit around the police station? Yes, thank you. Oh, that's good. Well, Mrs. Raven, we're going to sign the book for your dog and then you can get off home. You right can go as well, I think. So if we go this way. Right. The little dog didn't like being locked up in the kennel, but she's happy now that she's going home.